This is what you call a glueless install. Completely glueless. Hey everyone, welcome back. So today we are doing a completely glueless wig install. Go ahead and subscribe because we do some real wig melts over here. My name is Marie. Be sure to like the video. Matter of fact, this entire week I think I'm going glueless. We're going to do some glueless installs because I'm using melting sprays and adhesives and wig glues and tapes. We might need some glueless install for the ladies that just really want to wear a protective style. They want to grow out their edges, they want to grow out their hair. So we got to do it for you guys too. This is a 13 by 6 lace wig. It's not a closure wig. So everyone always do glueless when it comes to closure wigs. So I want to show you today how to lay completely melt down a 13 by 6 lace wig with using only the adjustable straps in the back to hold it. No glue, gels, nothing. This is a loose wave texture, comfortable, beautiful for a summer. There's no tangles. I'm not going to go through it too much. I don't want to frizz it up, but the loose wave don't have a lot of frizz anyways. But if you want something that's simple, this texture is definitely that. Links will be in the description box for this wig and I will also put a discount. Let's get into it. So this is the wig we're going to be working with. This is a 13 by 6 lace cap. You can see that the cap comes with combs and also an adjustable strap in the back. And also a comb right here. The knots are pre-bleached. The only hole I'm going to get with this wig is with these straps here. So I like to make it as tight as possible. So as you can see, I have it hooked as close as I can together that I know it will give a nice hold and also feel comfortable. This is what the lace looked like. As you can see, it is pre-cut. This is Swiss lace and Swiss lace is going to blend really well. So you don't need to do a lot to it. And this is a 13 by 6 caps. Unlike the closure wigs, you get lots of parting space. You can do so many styles with this. Pull it, put it on like this. When wearing a 13 by 6 glueless, um, you definitely want to make sure you are using the adjustable com the combs in the back and also any combs that may be on the side. This is the way it looks just putting it on. So pretty. I love the loose wave texture. You can curl it. You can straighten it if you would like. The easiest way to wear it is, of course, in its natural state. This is going to be as simple as it possibly can. So I'm going to go ahead and just melt it down. Because right now we're already glueless and it looks pretty good. Very sturdy, especially if you use the second adjustable band. So if your head is a little bit smaller, there is a second adjustable band that comes in most wigs that you can add in there. Use that. By the way, this is just a hair wax stick. It has no hold on it at all. It's just wax, basically. It's just going to lay down the hair.
So this is how you get a glueless wig install, completely glueless, no gels, no sprays, no adhesive, no tape, nothing. Um, and this is on pretty sturdy. Of course, with the glueless install, it's always going to be more for people who want to protect their natural hair or you're on a hair growth journey. And you just want to look decent while growing your hair out. You want to throw your hair in some cornrows for the next three to four months and boom. <laughs> That's what a glueless style is for. Like For those who actually want to like use it as a real protective style. I'm not saying you can't with hair glues. They can be a mess. So I wanted to show you that you can take a wig like this, the hair glueless, and make it look like it's laid and, you know, everything without using all of those products. So we still have the meltdown going on. So the details for this wig, this wig is from Pretty Lux Hair. This is a loose wave texture. Um, it does come with a pre-plucked hairline and this is a mini knotless wig. So I did add some concealer down the parting that's just something I do um but for the most part the knots are super small on this wig so it gives a more natural look especially when you're going glueless I did go back and bleach the knots myself but because they are so small if you don't know how to bleach knots you don't have to you can just add some concealer like I did the 13 by 6 can be worn glueless most of the time when you see people do a glueless install they are using closure wigs and i know a lot of you sometimes want the option to have more parting space so my sides and everything are laid pretty well i didn't gel them down or anything but i did just cut the sides down so that that i go like this it looks natural just you know having just softer sides the only thing i got going on as far as baby hairs would be this part here that's optional is in a 20 inch so the 20 inch stops about right there you can straighten this hair um, with the loose wave it's very versatile you can add curls to it it's almost like the body wave so it can hold a curl pretty good they do have an option to get this in a natural black I have it in a natural brown color which I feel like is more suitable for me if you need it in black they do have that option on the website along with getting the lace pre-cut if you don't want um, if you don't want to go through the process of cutting the lace, then you can get this wig in a pre-cut option. I also see that they do have small, medium, and large caps. So if you want a small cap or a large cap because you can't fit the medium, that option is also on there, which is great. And you can get the fake scalp method put in if you would like. I don't have the fake scalp method. I'm just wearing a wig cap as you guys seen. So yeah, I really love the way this turned out. It's so comfortable. And I can just take it off at night and put it back on in the morning. The style will still be there. And I don't have to do nothing to it the next day. So I will have this wig linked below in the description box. Be sure to check there. And I will also put a discount code down there for you guys. Hope you all have a wonderful week. And I will see you back in my next video.